It's mandatory for skiers, wakeboarders, and tube enthusiasts to wear inherently buoyant PFDs or life jackets while being towed. If you hit the water hard, you might get knocked unconscious and need that life jacket to help keep you afloat until the boat returns. High impact PFDs and life jackets are available that protect the wearer from injury should they hit the water at speed. These life jackets are constructed with three or four adjustable chest straps for a secure fit. If there's a front zipper, it will be constructed with reinforced seams to ensure the impact of a high speed fall won't cause the zipper to fail. Some models also feature a high padded collar which increases head support and protects the neck from overextending in the event of a tumble. For infants and children, life jacket wear is particularly critical, not just for towing but for any time that a child is on board. Check the label in the jacket to ensure it's suitable for your child's weight and make sure that it fits properly. Onboard towing or spotting, you may elect to wear one of the new inflatables. However, keep in mind that these are only legal for people 16 years of age and over, weighing more than 36 kilograms. Inflatable PFDs, be they manual or auto inflate, are not inherently buoyant when not inflated and therefore must be worn when on deck to be effective and legally compliant. The pouch or collar styles are comfortable to wear all day, but do come with some responsibilities. Specifically, regular inspections. Verify that the CO2 cylinder has not already been discharged. If you see green, it's okay to go. Periodically, inspect the jacket, which includes manually inflating it and leaving it overnight to verify that it holds air. Whatever jacket you choose, make the right choice and choose to wear it.